Microtubules are small uh, tubular filaments that organize the inside of cells and they are generally involved in transport. Um, transport of cargo inside the cells but also outside the cell. Microtubules are important for essential cellular processes such as cell division and um, defects in the function and organization of microtubules can lead to disease such as cancer or developmental defects. And one very complex um, structure composed of microtubules is the mitotic spindle that segregates chromosomes during cell division. And one major contribution was um, that we provided insight into the architecture of this complex structure. Another important contribution was on microcephaly, which is a rare disease causing small brains in affected uh, patients. It's caused by mutations in specific genes that affect microtubule organization. And um, we were able to provide um, a mechanistic insight into the basis of this disease. One of the cell types that we study in the lab are neurons. And uh, there are two aspects to the function of neurons. One is uh, the understanding of neurodegeneration, which um, occurs, for example, in Alzheimer's disease and is also believed to involve uh, microtubule-based transport defects. And the other is regeneration. So neurons, uh, after injury, need to regrow these uh, cellular extensions. Uh, and this is believed to also require microtubules. Over the last few years, there has been a shift in science towards more applied, more translational research. We should not forget that what drives major discovery is basic research. And this is research driven by curiosity and not by disease. The personal object that I brought is a boomerang that I built as a teenager. And it symbolizes three things. First, it's manual work, which I enjoy very much doing outside the lab. The second is that it uh, symbolizes curiosity because the first thing I thought when I saw this was how does it work? How does it fly and come back? The last uh, aspect is internationality, the aspect of having uh, people from different countries and different cultural backgrounds work together in science is something that I also enjoy very much. Mm -hmm.